So Symphony and Mommy are about to do a chilly weather activity. Oh, we're reunited. I love you, honey. I love you too. <laughs> we have made our way to... We're in this together. Good morning, guys. How do you like my twist braid I did this morning? It's a cold, snuggly morning here in Texas. Our weather just can't make up its mind, so Symphony and Mommy are about to do a chilly weather activity. Yeah, this is a little big for me. Oh yeah, let's trade. <laughs> You guys ready to cook? You ready to bake? Yes. Yes. Okay. So make the mix and mix up. Yeah, let's like smash banana. Okay, we'll move on to the next step. Let's see, what is it? Yay, egg! Mixy, mixy, mixy. Oh, I love this one, vanilla beans and stuff, but I do not like flavor ice cream. Are you ready? Do you want to dump it? Yay! Oh. Good job! <gasps> Is it so pretty, girls? Yeah. Do you need the spoon, Sissy? Uh -huh. Oh, you oh, got it. No, I don't. Oh, cool, and I get a mason jar to keep. I love it. You got to get them really good and mixed in there, Jules. Mixy, mixy, mixy. Mix up the cookies. Mix up the cookie, yeah. Nice. You guys, I gotta hand it to this girl over here. The cookie dough wasn't sticking together and Symphony was like, I think we need to add water. And I was like, no, the recipe doesn't say add water. It'll work itself out. And then I come over to the tag and I'm reading at the very bottom and it says, if dough is not sticking together, yeah. add one to two tablespoons until it reaches desired consistency. Yeah. You're so smart. Give me kisses. Mwah. That cooking class really paid off. I could learn a thing or two. What's up guys? How you doing today? I'm not doing so hot. <laughs> As you can see, my hand is stuck in the peace sign position. Oh wait, maybe this is like a military thing. That's what it is. The two fingers is a military thing. It's like that way. Coming up. That way. What's up little buddy? How you doing today? Look at I found my trucks. Sure did. I was supposed to leave earlier today. I woke up with a bad, bad headache, man. Real bad. All I had left was half an Excedrin. I took that and I still have the headache. And I can't work today because my finger is still going to leave early. My fingers pretty much kept me up half the night. It was bad. That's my complaint for the day. You want to see the cookie? Let's oh, let cool. me see. <gasps> Ding dong. <gasps> wow, those look good. Okay, we're making batch number two. This one's a little different though. Cookie cutter style. Oh yeah. Make, you ready, make look? a hairball, make a hairball. Can you push? Push down on hairball. Oh, Sophie, you're such a good big sister. Okay, guys, our second batch is baking nice and warmly in the oven, and it's time for us to try batch number one. Mmm. Mm. <laughs> is it good? You guys, technically, I'm on a no sugar diet for the next like seven days, but I've got to have a bite. I'm not going to eat the whole cookie, just one bite. I'm going to control myself. Ready? Mmm. Do you like them, Symphony? Mm hmm. They're really good. They taste just vanilla y and sugary. Oh, I like them. They're good. In spite of my headache, I'm trying to finish the job that I started yesterday before shrapnel exploded into my pointer finger. It's not hurting right now, so I'm gonna 
do what I can with this wood. I gotta show you guys this awesome axe I got. So this is your traditional splitting axe right here. It's a still, that's what they generally look like. This is an engineer splitting axe. This is made by Chopper USA. This is all they make. It's just a uh, company here in USA that he makes these and it's just such a sweet, sweet little guy. When you go down onto the wood with a blade right here, these guys separate, boom. They hit either side of the blade and it helps split that wood and helps push it apart. And what's also cool about this, it also prevents the ax from going in too deep and getting stuck. So when you're coming down, boom. This goes into the wood and as it goes in about here, these boom, spreads out. Boom, three pieces out of one. Yeah. Is that not sweet or what? I wish my head wasn't throbbing right now. Man, I love chopping wood. Never had a reason to do it before. This is my first time. Yesterday was my first time when I got hurt. Second time today, and I think I'm already improved quite a bit. We have made our way to Bubble Bubble. Oh yeah. Gonna have a little more girl time before the boys get home today. chose Disney sorry this is gonna be so much fun where's your chips I think so bubbles for you thank you bubbles for you nummies this is a non sweetener smoothie there's no sugar no kinds of fake sweeteners or anything just peach ice and water pretty good though are you sharing Sister. She wants a handshake. Good game. Sticky hands. Look at my girl getting my baby girl out. I said, what made you do that? And she said, because you're not feeling good. So sweet. My salad had avocado in it and I only had like three bites of the avocado. But every time I eat avocado, it upsets my stomach. It's a weird feeling. It's like a fatigue comes over me too. No, don't close the door just in case our little hands accidentally get in the way. Do you guys have any reactions to foods? I'm curious what other people have out there. I mean, I know there's obviously like nut allergies and lactose intolerant, but random things like avocado is just so random. And I love it, but my stomach hates it. We're done cleaning up here. Abram and I are about to head out. And I'm gonna miss this place this time. I'm really not ready to leave. I'm just so proud of this wall, guys. It's a dream come true. It really is. I've always wanted to build. And here's my first wall. It's significant it's for following your dreams, you know? And for having confidence in yourself, believing in yourself that you can do things. Because this kind of thing, it seems difficult. It really does, like, oh, I'll leave that to the professionals. If you guys recall, like maybe last month or something, I was looking down this hallway that was all, the walls were all falling over. And I was like, you know what? I need to hire a contractor to come out here. This is just too overwhelming. So many times I've felt defeated. I'm not even close to done, but I've already improved the main wall in this house significantly. It's a really good feeling. Look how straight this wall is. I mean, this thing, it's straight and it is sturdy. You ready to hit the road? Yeah. Appropriate clearance. Trace had printed out an excerpt from my Senate confirmation hearing less than six months earlier. As she and the kids sat behind me that day, senators had pressed me on how, as Deputy Attorney General, I would handle the obviously will make policy judgments when people disagree. Daddy said he was on his way home a few hours ago, well, a couple hours ago, so everybody yeah. is here at the door We're waiting, shy. including Oreo. We can go outside. Yay! Yay! Are you guys excited to go outside? We just came in from outside like yeah. 10 minutes ago. Yeah. <laughs> They're here. Juliet hasn't noticed yet. I knew. I knew. I knew. Is that daddy's car? No. Go. No? No, go. <laughs> Mommy, they brought yeah, something I'm home. Cool. They brought something home. They brought that thing home. Oh, weird. Hey. Yeah. Aww. You have applesauce? My turn. Abram! Abram! Here's a cookie for you. It's a sugary oatmeal cookie. It's a unicorn cookie. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, babe. Gluten-free, sugar-free. 
but it's not glitter free. I will say that. <laughs> There's glitter it's in there. It's not glitter free? <laughs> it was tradition that every Jewish male be circumcised on the eighth day after his birth. This set him apart as Jewish. While the reasons are many and complex, two of the most common reasons for circumcision are to get rid of unneeded skin and to help with cleanliness. Let's just do a different, this is all about that. When the parents brought the child Jesus to do for him what the custom of the Lord required, Simon took him in his arms and praised God saying, Sovereign Lord, they were just taking care of business that morning when he got up. Simeon didn't know what this day was that he'd waited for. No angels woke him from sleep. It was just a feeling, and then he was there, the Messiah. Oh, we're reunited. I love you, honey. I love you, too. Let's do comment of the day. How about it? It goes to Sophia Kamen. And it goes to her because I had this plan on the way home from Oklahoma. Sam, a while ago, you said you were going to make a 360 intro. Are you planning on doing that? Yes, I am planning on doing that. I've just been waiting for the right moment. I think it's going to be tomorrow at the Jubilee. That'll be so good. Yeah, that'll be a fun What's intro. What a good idea. But yeah, we're going to get back to that intro. Now of you Our liked original it. intro was from the Jubilee. Remember oh, I had that yeah. scarf on my head or something? I was going down the slide. And you and Eric were like going crazy on that thing. Was that at the Jubilee? Yeah, that was the crazy. Jubilee. Wow, what a coincidence. So yeah, our new one is going to be at the Jubilee again. All right, guys, we will catch you tomorrow for that. It's going to be really fun. But don't forget, guys, we, we love, love you. you. And, and remember, remember to, to love, love each other. other. You ready? Please don't do that angle. All right, it's a great angle. No, it's terrible. What I showed my double chin. <laughs> I think it looks great. I don't like this look on me.